Hey everyone, so I'm going to do a vlog today because I'm starting a new routine. Guys, I'm so tired. I don't understand these sleeps that I'm having. Like, yesterday I slept like 12 o'clock. That is never, like I don't remember a time that's happened since I was like, you know when you're a teenager? Like, my face and everything is like so swollen because of these deep sleeps. I don't know if they're really deep or they're not deep. I don't know because I feel like I haven't had a sleep like that in a very long time. So, Literally yesterday just slept in. I think it might be because, do you remember that bird that I had in ballet? I feel like that always woke me up and I feel like there's no sound here because I live in the country and like the no sound is just zonking me. So anyway, what was I gonna do? Yeah, because I'm seeing Jack today and I just wanted to vibe because I need to like organize a lot because I've just been kind of in isolation, which doesn't work well for me because I'm an extrovert. So, you know, like in like lockdown, some people just like smashed it and they were just like, I think they're introverts and they just like strive on their own like that. And I just don't strive like that. So I was just, I don't know. And then obviously I've come back from Bali and, you know, I was so sad to leave. Like I really didn't want to leave. But at the same time, I knew I had to come back because I have my brother's wedding and, you know, my boyfriend's here. So I was like, right, I'll come back for the summer. But I'm kind of in that vibe where like, oh, I miss my own space, even though like I don't mind love my own dad's, but I'm just like, I actually would love my own space, but like there's nowhere to live right here unless I go to the city and then it's so far away from everyone. But I don't know, we're just vibing with it for now and I'm allowed out now because I'm not in isolation anymore. So hopefully I will be feeling better. Um, I'm finding it hard to get a routine because um, usually my all my classes are at 9 a.m. So I get up at seven without fail every day usually 7 a.m and then I have those two hours before I go to class so that's kind of like my vibe um and now there's a 9 a.m class so I have to do rather 7 a.m class or 6 p.m class but about 6 a.m class is so much better but it's just by the time it comes to 6 p.m I'm like no I don't want to go so like morning class works for me but obviously today I didn't get off for my 7 a.m class I was too sore from football because I started back at football yesterday I thought it would be fine, but I'm actually aching today. And mum got a new kitchen as well. And everyone was like looking to see it, but I feel like it's not. Let me see. So it's like, I told her, I was like, really nice white and plain so I can do Instagram videos. <laughs> but the light doesn't really come in here. So still all the stuff's gone missing because we had to do something with the worktop. Um, and then I like this big clock. It's so cute. And then she sort of went for like navy. I mean, she goes OTT with the color like, but. And my face looks really stretched because I've got one of those face masks on that stretch your face. So it's from Enviro. I can't remember what it's called, but it's like that Botox in a bottle. And it like stretches my face. Obsessed with it. But yeah, hay fever is a bitch. I'm gonna take a tablet now, but then it makes me dry. <gasps> Maybe that's why the sleeps. Because of the dry, because of the medi medication. Do you think? I don't know. Comment below why you think I keep having these crazy deep sleeps. It's not normal. Maybe my body just needed it as well. Because my, my body even feels like leaner. Because I was really putting a lot of pressure on myself the last two weeks. Of locked, or the last two weeks before I came home. Because I was like, no one has touched my body in four months. Like, someone's going to be touching my body. I want to feel good and lean. Plus... Can you hear this? You know Jack has lost two stone. Jack has lost two stone. Like it's not normal. It's like having a new boyfriend. I can't even deal with it. He looks so much younger as well, which is like not good because he's already four years younger. <laughs> so yeah, he's lost two stone. So that kind of motivated me as well. It's like, I want to feel really good when I, but then obviously when I seen him, I was like, oh, he wouldn't even have cared. Um, so I put a lot of pressure on my body the last two weeks. Like I was double training and stuff. And then I didn't train at all in isolation just that one day. Um, so my body, I think, has actually been like, yeah, you need that, babe. So like, you really need to relax. So yeah, that's all I have to say right now. I'm going to have some coffee and wake the fuck up and plan my day. So I need to do some restorative yoga before I go to the gym because I'm so sore from Gaelic. So restorative yoga is just like yoga where you're on the floor and you're not doing like crazy stances. So I just do down dog. Tata flush are making me feel like I'm hungover or drunk or something so yeah okay, we was going to the gym and then what happened was it's closed 
between one and three. I don't know what that's about, but it's a thing in our town. So close between one and three. So I was like, oh, Jack has a gym in his house. So I was like, I'll just go to Jack's gym. Um, but he's not there, he's at work. Um, he's teaching, um, but his brother's there. And I haven't seen his dogs yet, right? Now his dogs are mad about, I don't know if they're mad about me or they're mad about this car because as soon as they see this car, they need to associate it with wax because they always go in my car. Um, and I haven't seen them yet, so I don't know which way, I don't know if they'll remember it or which way they'll go on, so we'll see. Oh, my new, my new bottoms. Look at my new clothes. You're so cute though. Let me hug. Hmm? <laughs> I'm vlogging. <laughs> Sorry, it's Stella Ramsey. I don't want to see you. We're still waiting to see Jack with C first. <laughs> That's the air badge there, the air. Um, it's kind of like a bit of a vibe, but it um, just looks like this. It's cute though, isn't it? So I was like, I'll just do this for like half an hour and then I'll, I'll have done something and I'll go back to normality tomorrow, maybe when I'm not on these choicy freaking things. <laughs> what is life? I don't know if you can see, but the dogs <laughs> wrecked my whole life that but sure what can you do not going anywhere am i so i'm all ready for my little date night with jack um this is our first date night. Actually, we don't really get any really date nights because we met in lockdown. So we've been on very little dinner dates. I was actually really surprised when he was like, I'm gonna take you for dinner on Tuesday. I was like, um, are you planning something that I don't know about? I'm obsessed. So yeah, I'm excited. I literally can't wait. I can't wait. You think I look nice? Hmm? You think I look nice? Um, we do. Oh, thank you. <laughs> I don't know how to use the vlog life. This is the vlog life, everyone. This is my dad. He's probably a bigger vlogger than me. And Maybe on a Saturday night, I thought this was about the only vlog in Aberdeen. Dad was out one night and these girls were sending me loads full of small and I, was, I couldn't deal. But you were loving it, weren't you? Of course. Uh, I'm going to go to Genesis, Genesis, and yes, I'm going on a date yes. tonight. Are you surprised? Not really. Why? We should be taking you on a date every weekend. Exactly. <laughs> exactly <laughs> my point. Is any kind of man at all? Do you take mum on a date? No. <laughs> Okay, Are we match? Sort of. Hello? <laughs> Have you missed me? Huh? Have you missed me? I did a lot. No. A lot, it's, lot. It's weird though because it doesn't really feel like, you know, you thought it would be your initial phase there, but it feels like you've just been home the whole time, doesn't it? Yeah, because we seen each other last night and we, were, we thought we'd be awkward, but we're not awkward. No. We're just, we're just, just like the same. <laughs> so like, he's, he's alright, like. And, yeah, we did, I, I actually was nervous. I was like, I'm going to be ox. But I was an ox. We're just the same. It's like I never <sighs> can't date. So now we're going to Fitzroy's Nere because we're not getting drunk tonight, so there won't be drunk shacks. No. We're waiting for um, Joe and Jack's finish university. Friday, last day. Friday's the last day. We won't be getting drunk this weekend because we both have football. No. I know we're back to football. Yeah, so I have football on Saturday night. For shite. Like the games on Saturday night. I won't be certain, like, so it won't really matter to be honest. Do you like, might, like, never know. Um, I have been playing. Kickstarter on Friday, I'll have Friday. Kickstarter will be in Kickstarter on Friday. The match. 
watch Jock. You want to watch it? Yes, of course. I have the ultimate wag life. <laughs> so, I'm like, what else am I going to be doing? That's true. Exactly, my whole life revolves around you here, so we have to get used to it. <laughs> um, and yeah, that's all the crack for now, and we're just going to love each other back. <laughs> How many stars would you give Fitzroy's? Oh, five out of five. Why? Definitely. Why? Because it's 50% off on Tuesdays. <laughs> it's not a 30% off? Oh, it's still 30%. Oh, lucky. But I knew that too in the game. <laughs> I didn't take it. I was like, why are you asking me on a date on the Tuesday? It's not like you. <laughs> There's your reason. But I was like, what the hell? But then I walked in and said 30% off. I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> I thought it was 50. It was 50 before COVID. <laughs> Go for us? No, you have to go into the soul. You look so handsome. Go actually though? Yeah. <laughs> I've had one porn star martini to be honest. No. So you're nearly steaming? I am. By the way, steaming in, Eng in Ireland doesn't mean the same as England, so I'm just. Yeah. Well, what's what steaming mean there? Steven in Liverpool. You never heard what that means. Oh, here. does that mean like Harvey? Yeah. <laughs> <Is that enough? laughs> You're a Steven. No. <laughs> um, and then that's really it for the vlog. We just went back to Jack's house and he read the newspaper we had tea. Trying to see the bit about me. <laughs> <laughs> no. Not even a mention. <laughs> Can't get a mention when you didn't do anything. <laughs> <laughs> We're joking. Your man didn't do anything because she defended him so well. I vouch for that. And then we just went to sleep. Um, I think that's it. Let me know what you think of my vlogs at home because they're obviously very different from Bali. So, bye, Ron. <laughs>